Dr. Jeff here with you again this week. I hope everybody had a good week uh, after Thanksgiving weekend. Uh, as you're driving around, uh, now you start to see these orange, orange globes kind of sitting everywhere called pumpkins. Uh, very popular for Halloween. Uh, of course, pumpkin pie for uh, Thanksgiving is always a favorite. I thought today we'd talk a little bit about, uh, about pumpkins. Pumpkins are not just, a, not just an orange blob, they are a superfood. What does that mean? Well, pumpkins are part of the squash family. They, uh, they're more of a fruit than a vegetable due to the way the seeds are and everything, so it's considered more of a fruit, um, but it's considered a superfood. Uh, what does that mean? Well, it means it's nutrient rich and it's fiber rich. Um, fiber rich means that uh, there's lots of fiber in it. Uh, fiber is really good for your digestive tract. Um, it, uh, it's really good for losing weight because it makes you feel full without uh, a lot of calories. Uh, some people use it uh, with their dogs and the dogs are having some digestive issues as well. Um, nutrient rich wise, well it's full of a really good nutrients. A half a cup of uh, pumpkin gives you 100% of your recommended vitamin A, uh, vitamin E, also it's vitamin C, vitamin B12, uh, iron, zinc, manganese, um, uh, magnesium, copper, all these great nutrients are in it. So it's really, really nutrient rich. Uh, and it's 95% uh, water, so like watermelon, you don't get a lot of calories when, you, when you're eating it. Um, it's also uh, very, very uh, good in antioxidants. So antioxidants are, are very good for prevent preventing things like cancer. They found pumpkin to be very good at preventing uh, lung cancer or prostate cancer, but it's very good at, at helping everything. Uh, it's very good for your heart. Uh, it's very good for your skin. The uh, vitamin A and vitamin E in it uh, keep your skin looking young. Uh, and, and soft and really good for your eyes. They have found that uh, pumpkin's really good at, uh, at warring off uh, cataracts and macular degeneration, uh, improves your night vision um, and things, so it's really good for that. Um, they are doing more research now into sleeping. They have found that uh, pumpkin seeds are really high, high in uh, tryptophan, which is a precursor for serotonin, which helps you sleep. There's a company out there that called ZevDev that has a powder, uh, pumpkin uh, seed powder that you can use uh, before we go to bed to help you sleep. Um, I remember as I was a kid, uh, we used to carve the pumpkins and we take the seeds out and roast them uh, in the oven. You know, put things in, you can either, you know, a little bit of butter or some salt or, or some other types of uh, uh, ginger or other types of spices uh, that spice up the pumpkin seeds. Eat them, you can eat them raw or you can eat them uh, roasted. It doesn't really matter. You're gonna get the same amount of tryptophan whether they're roasted or they're raw uh, with it. So pumpkin is a really good thing to eat. Uh, there's lots of different ways you can get it. Of course, you've got the famous pumpkin pie um, that everybody really likes. Um, you know, there's, there's muffins. You can make pumpkin muffins with bread. There's pumpkin soup. Do much like squash soup. Um, lots of different ways you can get pumpkin in. I had one lady who uh, cubed her, her pumpkin up. <clears throat> She'd go out and buy the inexpensive type of, uh, of white cheddar macaroni and cheese and cook it up for her kids, and she put pumpkin in and it would change it to a, an orange color to make it look like it was a real craft dinner. Uh, really good nutrient additive, and the kids didn't know the difference, and they're getting a good, uh, I guess, superfood out of it. Um, so instead of you know throwing out your pumpkins into the into the composting after Halloween, uh, I want you to take it and cube it up, and maybe put it in the freezer. And and uh, on this video, uh, link to this video will be a whole bunch of uh, uh, link to a bunch of different recipes. You can take the pumpkin out <coughs> and use it to cook some stuff and and get the, the, the big benefits out of eating a superfood. I'm Dr. Jeff. If you have any questions about this video or about pumpkin or anything I'm talking about, you can always talk to me on Facebook uh, or email me at jgoldswealth.com. I'm Dr. Jeff. I've got your back.